Yo, what's going on guys? It's Leaf here and today I am going to be showing you guys how to have multiple HUD profiles in Fortnite Mobile. Kind of like how to how to like experiment with different HUDs and like use different HUDs but without losing your HUD. Because I know a lot of people, I mean they like probably want to try out different HUDs and stuff like that but they don't want to lose their HUD because they've spent so much time making it and perfecting it and that sort of thing. And you know, but maybe you wanted to make slight adjustments or change stuff up or just totally try out a new HUD but you don't want to do that and you're in a sense limiting yourself almost to how well you can play because you're scared of losing your HUD that you already have muscle memory and skill on and stuff like that and you want to be able to go back to it after you're done trying out a new HUD or something like that. So I'm kind of going to be showing you guys a way to do this. Um, I do this when I want to like experiment with my HUD a little bit. Sometimes I'll do this or if I um, want to just completely try out a new HUD. Um, so what you want to do, obviously right here, go into your HUD layout tool. Here you see you have your HUD. Make sure you have your HUD saved, right? So, um, just, like touch something just slightly move. But, like. So now, gonna ahead click apply. Make sure you have like this this HUD saved into your device as the like onto your account rather as the last thing saved into your iCloud because you can load it in from the iCloud. So go ahead, click exit, click exit. Um, go ahead, log out of your Fortnite account. Now you're gonna go ahead. Log into an alt account or something like that that you don't really use. I don't know what I just clicked on there. But go ahead, sign into that. I'm going to have to probably blur this. Alright, and then go ahead and put in the password. Alright, so. Now we are signing into this Fortnite account. Alright, so basically what you're going to do once you're in this account is go ahead and, um... Let me actually... Oh turn that off what you're gonna want to do is now go into your HUD right here right so HUD layout tool all right so here's your HUD same HUD from before on the other account but now let's say you want to switch it up you know you want to let's just, let's just use the default HUD for example so let's say reset not reset would you um, reset all right there boom so you know what you, you just don't want to play claw right now you kind of just want to Hop into a game. Actually, this yeah. We do. We hop into a game and just play on the default HUD for fun. You don't feel like playing claws. You just do two fingers. I don't know what your reasoning behind this is, but you could come onto this account right here, and you could just play on this account with this HUD. But really, this is actually not going to solo. What you can also do now, and this is where it gets tricky. All right, you got to be very careful to not lose your HUD when you do this. Sign back into your normal Fortnite account. In your normal Fortnite account, log into that. Alright, so now as you can see, we are on this account. I would recommend if you want to make sure you save your HUD, just stay away from the HUD layout tool because there's no point in going there. You can't change anything. I'm just going to open it really quick, show you guys. Boom, I have the default HUD, but I'm on this account. You might be thinking, oh no, make um, oh no, he lost his HUD, right? Like, now, what is he going to do? He doesn't have his HUD. Well, let's go ahead, hop into a solo game really quick. All right. <clears throat> Just so I can show you guys. All right, as you can see, we are in the solo game. You know, we have the default HUD set up. Nothing, nothing too special. You know, it's just the default HUD layout um, that you get. You know, automatically because I just reset the widget. So, uh, or the, not the widget, the, the layout. Anyway, so yeah, here's the default HUD layout. You know, you got all the basic, the basic stuff on here. Anyway, so now you're like, okay, I'm tired of playing with this HUD. So you go back into your HUD layout. You click, open this up right here. You click load from iCloud. Confirm, boom, you have your normal HUD back, just like that. So yeah, if you guys want to basically, how it works is, you just have to go into a different a Fortnite, different Fortnite account, change your HUD in there to however you want it. I would honestly just recommend playing on that account, but if you want to do it on your normal account, you can sign back into it, and just kind of mess around, do whatever you want with that, um, and just like kind of like experiment around 
but just make sure you change any changes you make to it or save make sure you do it on a different fortnite account so you don't lose your normal hud on your main account so yeah that's basically i hope i explained that well if you have if you're confused or have any questions in the comments um just kind of ask me any questions i can hopefully try and respond to them but yeah that's how you can kind of experiment with different huds kind of have a hud uh different hud profiles I don't know why we don't have HUD profiles yet on Fortnite. That's something that I think we should have. So, um, Epic, if you're watching this, please add HUD profiles to Fortnite. That would be amazing. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day. Make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Use my supporter creator code, Leaf the Leopard, in the Fortnite item shop. And um, apparently, it got deleted. Hold on. Creator code, Leaf the Leopard, in the Fortnite item shop. And um, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good day. Peace out.